Hey Covenant, it's Pastor Justin coming to you on this day to talk about remembering. Now you remember from our video from last week, remembering can sometimes have a dash in it where we're talking about the theological concept of God remembering us, re-transforming us, reforming us. This process of naming us in to our sense of identity, calling, and purpose. This deep sense of what it means to kind of be rearranged inside of ourselves, that our stories from the past, whether they're stories of celebration or stories of pain, can be rewired inside of us to help us look towards the future and see the good that God is going to do, that stories can create resilience in us, as well as a restoration of hope inside of us. And so this season of transition that we are in is about remembering and allowing these stories to be rewritten inside of us so that they do not become stories that increase our anxiety. They don't become stories that hold us down and keep us back, but instead become stories that become springboards for our present and for our future. And so I want you to begin making the turn inside of yourself. What are the beautiful, wonderful stories? The stories of appreciation, the stories of abundance, the stories of goodness, grace, and hope that you have in your experience and encounter and relationships here at Covenant. And how will you allow those stories to build a deep sense of hope for your future together? It's in those kinds of questions, friends, that we begin to build a future for the church, that we begin to build on the legacy of those who have come over the last 50 years. Did you know this year, 2023, is the 50th anniversary of Covenant Presbyterian DTC? That 50 years ago, a group of people dreamed together, met together, and said, let's build a new church. Let's put something in the heart of Greenwood Village that will outlast us. And indeed, you all are here right now in DTC. Part of Greenwood Village, part of Denver, part of Englewood, part of Centennial, part of all these little places that come together to form this kind of general area of the Denver Tech Center and drawing people from all over the region to your church. And as you are imagining your future, that future is deeply embedded in your past. And there are parts of your DNA as a church that you wanna take and go, ah, that's the real us. And there are parts of that DNA that you wanna cast off, just like our own biological system does. Comes in and goes, you know what? That part's not working, let's And then these other parts that we go, this is who I really am. These are the parts that I want to be. These are the parts that will allow us to thrive. And so friends, that's the process that you and I are in. This is the journey that we are on. We are remembering so that we will be transformed for the future. So as you remember, know that you're not stuck in the past. Instead, allow those stories to generate hope for tomorrow. Thanks, everyone.